Have you ever pushed a swing at the park or pulled open a door? Then guess what? You've used a force. A force is a push or a pull. Forces make things move, stop, speed up, or change direction. Today, we're going to learn about two different types of forces, contact forces and non-contact forces. Let's start with contact forces. These are the forces you use when you touch something. That's why they're called contact forces, because you make contact. If you push a toy truck, pull a wagon, or kick a ball, you're using a contact force. You have to touch it to move it. Now let's talk about non-contact forces. These ones are really cool because they work even when nothing touches. One kind of non-contact force is gravity. Gravity pulls things down to the ground. If you jump, you come back down. If an apple falls from a tree, gravity pulled it. Another non-contact force is magnetism. If you've ever played with magnets, you know they can pull things like paper clips without touching them. That's because magnets create a force from a distance. So let's remember this. Contact forces happen when something is touched. Non-contact forces happen without touching. Both types of forces make things move, stop, or change direction. Next time you play or move something, try to be a force detective. Are you using a contact force or a non-contact force?